Happy Chinese class. 快乐汉语小课堂 Hello, everyone. I'm Lily Huang. 我是黄老师 Learning how to give an invitation and respond to an invitation like a native Chinese speaker are very important. It might cause some misunderstandings between you and your Chinese friends if you behave as you would in your own country. Lin Jie, you are in Shanghai. Um, have you something? Do you think I am handsome? Cool? You are handsome. So handsome, so cool. You are already not liking me. 我每次请他吃饭、看电影，他都说不用不用。是吗？你是怎么邀请他的？李静，你明天忙不忙？明天周六不忙。那我请你来我家吃饭怎么样？不用，太麻烦你了。啊，好吧。我的车来了，再见。哎呀，李静不一定不想去，在中国，呃，别人请你吃饭，你就算想去也要推辞一番。李静说的是客气话，是吗？那我该怎么做？继续邀请他呀。好吧。哦。In the West, people get used to accepting the invitation directly. Well, in China, when you invite some Chinese people to your house for dinner, they usually say no for the first time, even if they want to. They don't want to create a problem for a busy host, so they may say, 不用，太麻烦你了。No, I don't want to bother you. This is just a polite decline. As a host, you are expected to keep offering like this. 谢谢你教我中文。晚上我请你吃饭怎么样？不用不用，别客气啦。我们去吃中国菜怎么样？好啊，那我就不客气了。走。OK， so much today。再见。